nobody on base and the base umpire in his regular position, when there's a base hit out to the outfield, that umpire needs to come in here, get turned around ahead of the runner, and still watch the batter runner touch first base. The way we do this is a pivot. The pivot is basically a three-step movement. You want to make sure that you're in here on the infield grass, your left foot gets planted, right foot is a little jump as you watch the batter runner touch first base, and your left foot goes directly towards second base. You want to make sure that you're under control here so you don't pull yourself back from going away from the play that you need to get to. From here, it's just a simple cross step to stay ahead of the runner. If the batter runner goes back to first base, you simply cross step back to first base, turn and face the ball. You have the runner there and the outfield and the ball in front of you. This is a good position to be in. The pivot allows the umpire to get ahead of the runner and see him touch first base. If the runner goes back to first, the umpire follows so that the play is in front of him. On this pivot, with the runner going to second, the umpire must watch the ball and glance at the runner while moving into position to call any potential play. With the runner on first, the base umpire is positioned on a line tangent to the pitcher's mound between the mound and the infield cutout. The key is not getting too deep towards second base. Here's the movement to first base on the pickoff throw from the pitcher. The runner is out. The umpire moves a step or two toward the 45-foot mark, turns, and is set to call the play. On the steal attempt at second, the umpire cross-steps back as he pinches in toward second base for the proper angle. In slow motion, watch how he keeps his eye on the ball as he pinches in toward second base, then pulls his eyes ahead of the throw to make the call. three double play on a ball hit to short the umpire turns with the ball as it's fielded moves toward first base as the fielder throws to second and stops for the play at second in a standing set he makes the call at second while moving toward first base and gets set to call the play there watch the umpire's movement on the double play In slow motion, note that the umpire moves in the opposite direction from the ball. It might feel unnatural for him to go that way, but that's what the reaction should be.